Yeah, I've done 45 minutes on this. Now no Brad Pitfield. <laughs> Welcome everyone to the Super Odd channel. We're going to share with you some of the best social media clips we've seen from you, our customers, over the last few weeks. My name is Malcolm and this, this is Sam. Today's episode will actually be the first film in our dedicated YouTube studio that we, we've built on our site in, in the factory in South Wales. We will actually release a video a little bit later showing how we turned this, what was a storeroom, into what we're quite proud of is our, our debut YouTube studio. On, on to our first clip. The contributor is a guy called Peter from Vision Technology. For those who, who are quite in the trade, you may have followed him already on Instagram, uh, but he's got a really, really simple application here where he's used a couple of the different uh, Superod products and combined them to make such a simple solution, it blew us all away. AKA the Wizard of Oz, as far as we call him, because um, he is just a pure magician with the kit. Have a look at his video and then we'll discuss it afterwards. That is a prime example of how innovative our customers are. I've never seen anyone use that combination before. Um, it's the beauty of these videos that we're sharing that you know hopefully will help other customers to save times on their jobs because I think this is a brilliant way of using our products. We often talk about we sell a solution and you know we'll sit there and design a product, we'll put the pieces together. We have no idea how the customer's ultimately going to use the product because uh, you know we know what we design it for and we have a particular application or a problem in mind that we solve but then we get blown away by people like Peter who just combine you know different elements of the kit the tongue the magnet the chain they're just performing magic every day I think absolutely awesome example of what we want our customers to do it's brilliant and it just really shows a real life scenario the challenge he had there was he had a you know it was part of a CCTV install so obviously you know we wanted the, the camera to be in a prime position where it was going to survey the site accurately um, but also it needed to be discreet and it's on a residential property so we wanted it to, to, to look good and everything as well so not only did he get a quick install and it you know, really looked a neat job by the time he, he finished it and everything as well. So uh, yeah these are the products that was used in Vision Technologies video you know this is the the Cable Tongue Pro where we've put a super odd adapter on the end and you get a pulling sock that you can put, use on the end to attach your cables and pull it through. What was really clever about the way Vision Technology used theirs is these glow in a dark rod, a chain and a magnet that you find in the mega set and he needed to go through a 90 degree turn with another angle built into it to come down out of the soffit uh, so you basically you put this on the end send your chain through and although you can put this on another rod uh, what was clever about vision technologies video was he could actually use this to get a good angle to come down sometimes you send a rod up through a hole and it you're fighting with it to try and get it come back down to a, a track to the the, uh, the chain but this one you can just send it straight up he caught it really easy easy and then you can just get this around the 90 degree turn really nice so I thought it was a very clever way of using you know the mega set attachments with the cable turn it was perfect little uh, little fishing route this video is uh, Arlo electrical and uh, I know he's done quite a few of the videos we love all of Arlo's videos when he sends them in this one was the one where he was doing a sending a cable over a ceiling in a basement in a school in a changing room um, but this is a brilliant video and it just shows some of our customers have a lot of fun with our videos so yeah, watch this video and yeah, see if we can pick up some tips. I think the thing that stood out for me, Sam, on this one was just how much passion the guy's got for our product and everything. He works on his own, but he's such such a bubbly personality and a character. He's got his apprentice there in a tube and he, he pulls it out um, you know, to solve all the problems and everything. But what really say jumped jumped off the screen to me, it was just the passion for our products. And I think as as a manufacturer, when you see customers with that amount of enthusiasm about a real simple product like a light that we developed to go on the end of the rods many many years ago it makes it a good work day when we 
we see that sort of impact we're having on people. This one was one of my favourite videos that anyone have ever sent in. I, I love how much fun he's having with it and uh, I love how he even starts it. That he looks like he's going to you know, do a magic trick for someone. It's a simple install but using the super beam it's amazing really. You just put it on the end of your rod, you can see where the end of the rod is. It's so, it's, you know, it's such an easy product to use just to see that where the end of the rod is saves so much time on a job. But uh, yeah, he clearly has fun with this video and uh, yeah, it's almost like a magician's. Arlo's sporting a bit of ink there as he's up in the, in the attic did make me think I wonder if he's going to be a candidate for one of the first UK Sparks to go that far and have one of the client tattoos like we see a lot of the Sparks in the US have could be a candidate there we'll have to have a chat with him and see if there's a, a client tattoo appearing anywhere soon or a super odd one yeah, as well. yeah I guess yeah. super odd on his arm or something <laughs> <laughs> or you, super beef, you can do as well. You, you never know, you never know. <laughs> These are the products that uh, we used in Arlo Electrical's video. Simple little tool, really. You've got a super beam. Uh, you've got three little button batteries in there. Put that on the end of the rod. As soon as you screw down, it makes the connection, turns the light on, and it just, yeah, it, it literally lights the way through. It's so much easier to use. You know, you can see exactly where the end of the rod is and see where you're rooting it. You know, you're not stabbing around in the dark trying to find where the end of the rod is. You can literally see it coming straight towards you. So yeah, the Super Beam, you can get this in the Deluxe set or in the Mega set, or you can buy it separately as well to add to your existing set. Final, final one of the day is Cam Electrical. Everyone loves a magnet. And it kind of takes me back to when I used to work with my dad, who, who was a spark many, many years ago and he used to perform a trick i used to think it was magic when it used to sit there and he had a piece of jack chain and a magnet and somehow he would tease this chain through the wall next thing it would come out at the bottom he'd give it a yank and there'd be a cable attached and i used to sit there seven or eight years old looking in awe and think god my dad's a magician little did i know at that time that was going to be my career we just quickly run through the video we'll show that and i know sam's got some some, some thoughts on it and everything as well but it's real Simple product and shows an application on how, how he's solved what otherwise would have been, you know, qu quite a, a challenging install. So yeah, this next video from Cam Electrical, based down in Weymouth. Uh, yeah, it's a brilliant video using the Gecko Gripper. He uses it to fish cable behind a plasterboard wall, fishing cable for under cabinet lighting. He did it with minimal disruption. You know, he didn't knock holes in walls or anything like that. He just used the access points that was already there as well, using it for the extractor fan. He uses it in such a clever way. So I hope you pick up some tips from this because the Gecko Gripper is definitely one of those products that saves you a lot of time and it saves you going to get your rods in some instances as well. So yeah, give this video a watch and. Uh, We'll have a look at it after. Classic example of using the magnet, uh, not with a piece of string this time, but with a product we call the Gecko that was brought to us it's probably more than five years ago now, about maybe five, six years ago. And it was again developed by a contractor. This time it was a guy called Dave Reddy in Stockport, real nice guy, asked to meet me, said he had this idea. And I met this real shy, quite retiring guy, virtually a little bit embarrassed of his product. He said, look, I know I've got a stupid idea, but I just need to tell somebody about it. He said, I've shown it to a lot of my friends. They all think I'm nuts. I just believe in it. He had this little prototype and he pulled it together and he showed me. And I just said, Dave, there's no such thing as a stupid idea. You just happen to have a vision that's a little bit wider than the people you're mixing with at the moment. And I said, that was probably at the very early stage of us embracing ideas from you, our customers. Now I look back, one of the videos that we showed earlier about the cable turn, that was brought to us by a contractor. The Gecko brought to us by a contractor. You'll see other products in our range, like the Quick Reel. Loads of products you'll come across and their roots either lie in some of my own heritage or more up to date with the you know the experiences you, the customers, have brought us. So. The, the Gecko Grip is one of those products. It doesn't always work. There's obviously studs behind certain walls but when it is clear and you can send it through it just saves a lot of time and you can see how you know little disruption he causes and he just sends that cable through there effortlessly you know that is a masterful you know cable fish do you know what I mean like that that really does show you know that's 
there's a, the skill level there, set, being able to send it from one cabinet to the other, perfectly behind the wall and not messing around, no wasting in time. It's a brilliant demonstration of how to use the Ghetto Gripper. Though. This is the product that was used in Cam Electrical's video. So it's a really strong neodymium magnet. You've got six meters of draw and you've got a mini eye attachment you can attach a cable to. You can also use our pulling sock with it as well. But you basically, the two magnets come apart. The flat one you put up behind the cavity. On the outside of the wall, you attract it with a big magnet, and then you've got full control over it. As you can see, you can send it up. You can feel when it's attached and when it's not. You know, you can even feel if you hit a, 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 a joist in the wall, you can actually feel where the joist is. You can feel it fighting against you. You can literally just send it straight through, find the hole, pull it out. Such a simple little tool, but it saves so much time on a job. So yeah, that's the Gecko Gripper. You know, you can you, know, you can buy it online or in wholesalers, uh, but this is something that'll save you a lot of time. You know, it'll save you going back to the the van to get your, your mega set out of it you know you don't need to use rods when you've got this you can always try this first and give it a go but yeah it'll save a lot of time that's the ghetto gripper from the end customer's point of view it's a really neat and discreet installation as well you know obviously from the installer's point of view it's quick and it's efficient but you know ultimately the end customer the cables are invisible and that's what you know the challenge for all sparks is you know to make a, a sweet installation both in terms of time but also sweet as in the way it appears and you know nobody wants wants to see a load of twin and earth just nailed underneath the kitchen cabinet. The final part of this story, what, what seeing this video took me back to, I mentioned earlier on, um, a guy called Dave Reddy, the inventor of the product and everything. Well, from his stupid idea, I actually was in touch with Dave and he ultimately came to work for us for a little period of time and everything. For any of those of you out there that do have stupid ideas that you, you're keeping quiet about, or, you know, your mates are, teasing you about while you're on site, please give me a call, give me a shout. There'll be a contact details below. We welcome stupid ideas because it's amazing how smart some of these stupid ideas can be. So that's our first episode. Massive, massive thank you to Vision Technology at Arlo Electrical and Cam Electrical. Brilliant supporters of our products, brilliant content. I really think you've helped the community. Uh, with your tips and tricks on how to use the product and everything. Thank you very much for that. Look forward to, to sharing more of the content with the rest of the community. We will be actually showing you something shortly, which we're going to call the Wall of Fame, and where we're, we'll be putting anybody who's featured in these ongoing uh, videos. We'll give them a slot on our Wall of Fame, which will also it'll appear here in the YouTube studio, but it'll also be online and everything as well. And don't forget, all the products we went through today will be in the description below. Uh, if you like the video or dislike the video, you know, let us know in the comments. And uh, please subscribe if you want to see any more of the content in the future. If there are any products that you'd like to see featured or you see featured in whatever form of social media, tag us, copy us in on it and let us know and uh, you may have just given somebody a nudge there to be another uh, debut talk on our wall of fame. So thank you very much, hope you enjoyed the content. Bye from me and bye from Sam. Thank you very much. Like, subscribe. <laughs> A few moments later. Is it nearly brew time yet, Sam? We're recording when, when you're ready. Yeah, we've done 45 minutes of this. Now no Brad to Pitfields. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, oh yeah. kick me while I'm down. <laughs> Are we allowed to mention that Vanessa's 40 soon on camera? <laughs> this will be the last time this video is edited by a 30-year-old. <laughs> Click, subscribe. <laughs>